So thyme, as you know, which is this herb, and I've washed and re these, they so will um, just pass it around. Um, the benefit of thyme is good for treating things like colds, flu and sore throats, irritating coughs, so you can, you can drink the infusion. Uh, it's good for tonsils uh, when you have a sore throat as well and bronchitis. And it aids digestion and prevents bronchial uh, spasms like asthma. And I quickly learned that when I had a doctor's appointment one morning, um, I was uh, really suffering overnight, I was really gasping, I didn't have an inhaler, I rarely suffered from asthma, so I didn't have an inhaler at, at to hand, so I took it for granted that I wouldn't really need one much. And uh, I got up in the middle of the night, because I understood about time, helping to ease the spasms for asthma, and I boiled my thyme. This is a quick way of infusing a herb. If you don't have time to infuse it in water for four to six hours or night, you can boil it and drink it, hot or cold. You can store it in the fridge as well. So I drank this, and within minutes, um, the spasms have eased. I was able to breathe more clearly, and I had a very good night's rest. And I can also <laughs> say that I use it whenever I have a maybe a little long coming um, tightness of the chest because I might be in, you know, in contact with someone who's smoking or aerosols that tends to trigger me. I just drink uh, thyme water uh, up to maybe two, three times a day, and that that actually arrests it before it gets worse. Mm. <laughs> The, 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 the old company, you know, the tight, the, the lungs, so they don't get any tighter. It starts, the, the lungs start to close. And as soon as you have, I have some of the time tea, I find it relieves me straight away. So I'm not getting to that tight, very uncomfortable stage that asthma brings you to. Um, now, coughs can be soothed um, uh, while any congestion is moved um, from the body. This is time again, as I'm, as I'm mentioning. And mucus will be thinner um, and easier to cough up when you really take time. Um, it also has antibacterial properties uh, which kill off bacteria inside and outside the body. So in one of my workshops I had a lady who had a biopsy and the skin was a little inflamed and sore and it had, was a little bit yellow as well and was, had some leakage. And I told her to use thyme and dab it on the area and soon the skin became healed, it was, it was, it was um, smooth and there was no leakage. And, I tell, and also, just by knowing, understanding about thyme, I now use it as a cleanser. So, and it takes off eye makeup as well, which is wonderful, even waterproof eye makeup, like a stomachy. What a good and mascara you can take Just by boiling it up. Just by boiling it up, you can yeah, boil it, let it sit in the pan for right, strain it, and I put it into a glass jar a bottle and I have it in my bathroom for cosmetic use. And I take off I take off uh, any um, scar that I might have or just to cleanse the face because it's antibacterial outside and inside as well. You can drink it, you can use it externally. Um, it can be made to use into a strong tea um, to dis and also disinfect uh, skin and even surfaces, much like tea tree. I've, mm -hmm. I've used a little bit of tea tree, five parts of water, and it, it cleans all your surfaces and it gives your home a beautiful smell. You're not exposed to strong um, uh, toxins which cause you know, respiratory problems. Um, so finding those type of herbal alternatives is good as well. It's also uh, an immune boost, it has an immune boosting effect on the body and the numerous antioxidants that time contains helps your body um, uh, to maintain optimal uh, health and fitness. Um, it also has high, it's also high in iron, regular use of the herb can prevent anemia and other blood disorders. So if you find that you're very um, lethargic, um, drink time. And you can drink up to, say, maybe a litre a day. You can make it in the morning and take it to work. So it, you, it can substitute as your water intake as well. 